Hello everyone and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today we are looking into a general message for the next two weeks. If you find this message is helpful or resonating, please give it a thumbs up. Also guys, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome here and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So Aries, let's dive right in and see what we can see for your upcoming energy for the next two weeks. Most important message here for Aries Spirit, what do my Aries friends need to know? Aries. This reading is talking about you taking action on moving forward from a particular person in your life that has been draining your energy, has been draining your spirit. Similar message came out for Sagittarius reading. But I feel here, Aries, this has been an ongoing relationship but also the challenge has been an ongoing challenge for some time. We're going to clarify all of this here in a moment, Aries. The energy surrounding you, the Seven of Cups, the Death Energy, the Temperance Energy. What I see coming out, Aries, this person creates a lot of confusion, a lot of uncertainty in your life. I don't feel like this is multiple options. I feel like this person that you are trying to distance yourself or up in the air about distancing yourself from them at this time they have you very scattered they have you uncertain with what you want to do this is their energy that's coming out okay and i feel here to be honest with you aries it's like they're rubbing off on you and we're going to clarify all of this here in a moment part of the challenge is their back and forth. Part of, the, part of the time they're willing to work on this. The other part of the time they're withdrawing their energy. I feel here this has you really up in the air. Again, scattered about what decision you should make here for your long-term future. Now, Aries. Ultimately, I feel here intuitively you already know it's time to free yourself from this particular situation. But I also feel here an energy with the two of wands of waiting waiting to see so let's clarify for you now if you find the message is helpful or resonating please give it a thumbs up also guys if you like the vibe how i interpret the cards you're more than welcome to subscribe we're going to start here with the seven of cups the death energy and the temperance for the energy surrounding aries I feel here a need to say no more waiting it's time to take action. It's time to make a plan and move forward. And if this person comes along with, by all means, good for them. But if they don't, don't be afraid to move on. In this energy areas, I feel like you're standing your ground. You know exactly what it is that you want. This confusion is coming from this person Whenever they see you moving on, doing better without them, they rush back in because they're not certain with what they want out of their life. So again, Aries, don't accept anything less than what it is that you truly desire. And that's freeing yourself from situations that are causing sadness, causing pain, that are making you question if you're making the right decision or moving in the right direction. I definitely feel here with the hermit in the reverse. You have already gotten clear within yourself of what exactly it is that you want. Now it's time to start taking action here, Aries. 
So let's pull over the advice guidance moving forward. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. We have the Four of Swords, the Strength, the Ten of Cups, the Two of Cups, the Sun, with the Five of Cups energy. So Aries, be mindful, okay? This person is draining, okay? They are the ones that are causing the confusion. You are mirroring this person's energy. I feel here you're coming to terms with that and starting to recognize the difference between their energy and your energy, okay? I know there's a lot of happy times that you've had with this person, but there's also been a lot of negative times as well. So that balance is important, okay? But weighing the pros and cons, because you don't want to look back on this time in your life regretting any decision that you made, regretting that you didn't move on sooner because you were ignoring the warning signs, okay? This reading is coming out very clearly. If you want to get back to that happy space, Aries, you're going to have to put yourself first. Your four truths message coming out for your reading is don't make assumptions, speak openly and honestly. When you speak openly and honestly, you won't have to make assumptions. The day you stop making assumptions, you will communicate cleanly and clearly and achieve impeccability with your word. Speak openly and honestly. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So Aries, I feel like that's a good solid message coming out. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. And I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.